Welcome to a game called Original Journey. I just recorded a video on it, except that I didn't fucking record it, so that was awesome. It's a pretty fun little game. This is where I am now. But I'm going to just delete that data because... Yeah, fuck that. What the hell? Why'd it do that? Welcome to a game called Original Journey. I just recorded a video on it, except it didn't record, so let's start over. On the bright side, I'm now familiar with the game and won't suck. In the darkest part of the universe exists a strange world. Planet Shadow is a dangerous place filled with ravenous monstrosities and infinite horrors. That looks like a portal turret. But it's actually an AllSpark! So they made it here to Planet Shadow or whatever. They gotta save the world by collecting the crystals. That's all the story you need. So we wake up late. Because we are lazy. I'm going to kind of just speed through all this intro stuff because I've already seen it and I don't want to see it again. Tutorials are stupid. Blah, 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 blah. Welcome to Planet Shadow. You got to save our world. So let's do it, said the captain. But he noticed we got here late, and he's not ha that happy about it. So we get to be his meat shield. This is a person. There's a secret bar? I hadn't heard that one before. Apparently there's a secret bar in the base. No, this is the best character in the game. Vacuum baby! How the hell did you get here before me? So this game is, uh... It's tagged as a roguelike, but I don't think I'd really call it that. I mean, it just has random generated sort of islands you go to, and those are the levels. So here's our first gun. It's the best gun. It's a grenade launcher. You can't really aim it, so you just have to jump around. Not being able to aim it more efficiently is probably my biggest problem with this game, but it's a tiny problem. The second problem is that it's kind of easy. So we gotta get those crystals. And we summon Vacuum Baby. Vacuum Baby takes us to the next island! They all take about 20 to 30 seconds to complete. Oh no! It's gonna be an ambush! We need to summon our turrets. Which I almost never use, because they're pretty crap. Look how crap these turrets are!
Here's our second gun. The machine gun. This gun sucks. Now you see why that gun sucks. got an event. It was just the intro. Now the captain is done with us forever, and he's gonna turn us over to Sparkle! Sparkle's a dick! You wanna know why Sparkle's a dick? Because you have to watch Sparkle walk everywhere, and it's part of the tutorial, that's why. Do you even know who I am? I'm Captain Collins' famous assistant, Sparkle! See? Now we have to watch Sparkle walk in there. And we gotta follow. There's Sparkle again. Now we get to watch Sparkle walk over there. Yep, cool. Yeah, now we gotta go over there. Blah blah blah, there's two rooms here. One's for your well for your weapons, one's for your armor. Let's go in the weapons room, says Sparkle. And then we watch them walk there. And then follow. Get out of here, Sparkle, I don't care about you. There's not many weapons here, says Sparkle, but you'll get them eventually, she lied. I'm assuming it's a she. Oh. You wanted me to swap to something, or di didn't you? Oh, you wanted me to take two machine guns, because they're the best gun, right? Okay, now we get to unlock the second best gun. The shotgun! Do you know what the shotgun does that the machine gun doesn't? Be useful. That's what. Now we get to watch Sparkle walk to the firing range. Very impressive, Sparkle. Thank you for that demonstration. The machine gun's good for hitting enemies over time, but the shotgun just completely destroys them. But very unlimited ammo is the downside. Now Sparkle has to just flaunt her ego. Again, assuming it's a her because the name's Sparkle. Oh, I can find it, don't worry. I have to watch you walk there after all. And from henceforth, we will ignore the machine gun entirely, forever. This is weird machine is the changing room. Does that make sense? And we're gonna unlock our first suit. The newbie suit. Put it on. God damn it, Sparkle! Thank you. And you may not have noticed, but it gave me that thing on my back. Yay! It also boosted my stats. Whatever the three stats are by one. And now we watch Sparkle walk out there. And then we follow. This is why Sparkle's a dick. See? Now you all understand.
She says that there's a job from the, uh, like, the, the shop guy. What the shop guy wants us to do is buy his crap, which is expensive. So we're not going to go to the shop guy. We're going to go out and fight things. We'll be back here later. Once I've got the money. Let's just, uh, look at that real quick. Get that exclamation mark off of here. We'll go to the giant forest! I'm gonna have to be a little careful because I was at level 11 when I stopped recording. And I probably suck now, compared to what I was used to. Oh, it's starting me right away with the, the uh... With the lightning. That's good. So all these levels are this short, and they're kind of randomized. Sometimes you get this thing, which is cool, but not in this case! Get out! Wow, this is useless here, jeez. Stop getting back in, jeez. Let's get rid of the rocks, I guess. What a crappy level to get that thing on. Usually they're really big and just completely destroy everything. Oh well. Again? Alright. The walls have to go. And we just leveled up, which means we got full life. Please get out and stay out. Stop! Jesus Christ! I didn't see that until like 20 minutes in last time. Now it's everywhere. So I can summon turrets, but as I said, I hate them. At least the ones you start with, they're just garbage. Um, still doing good, let's go. Rude. Ha! The race. It's time for a race. Let's do it. Nope. This is upsetting. No! Luckily falling off doesn't kill you. It just hurts you badly. Likewise for those spikes. I don't actually know how to get from that platform. Oh, there's a platform down there. Oh well, whatever, it doesn't matter. All that matters is I get there before him. So that he doesn't eat me. Because, I mean... Who wants to be eaten? Nobody. I won. You can't eat me now. Oh no, he's gonna eat me anyway. Fuck off with your mask. Out. Okay. Cool beans.
Let's look for supplies. Well, that's not really enough health to make me want to keep going, so I guess we'll go back to the base for the moment. How much money did I get? That's not enough money! I'm gonna retreat anyway, because level 7 gets stupid. And if you die, you lose your stuff and have to go try and get it back. But we're just gonna go right back out, because I don't have enough money for the thing yet. Oh my god, why? Wow, that went great. Could have gotten two poison things from that plant. Alas. level. I have enough now. Let's leave. Let's look for supplies first, because sometimes that's cool stuff. It was not this time. That event was just about the lovely race. Nobody cares! Let's go see the shop guy! Buy his expensive garbage. Yo. I'll take it! Right, we gotta go see Mr. NG then. Find out what this AI module could possibly be for. Oh, but he's not here! We gotta go find him. I'd just like to say that the uh, art and music in this game perfectly fit each other. I think it's a, a nice chill atmosphere to murder things to. Alright, let's go uh, back to the forest, see if we can't find ourselves an NG.
Rude. Fucking die. Angie, where are you? Jesus Christ, no! What even hit me? Alright, so that's what happens when you die. They give you one chance to get your stuff back. By getting to that level and picking it up. Assuming, of course, it's not inside of the goddamn island, because it was the last time I played. That was real cool. It's okay. I was only, like, level two. Who cares? Dickens. It was your fault, wasn't it? You guys hit like a freight train. already? Really? He didn't die. Christ! Let's uh, look for supplies. Oh hey, there's NG. One moment, NG. I need supplies. Why did these ravenous beasts tie him up? Like, what? what is the point? I thought they were just trying to murder us and all that. Bitch! Bitch! We saved Enji! Now we can leave. We'll go talk to him later. We're not quite done exploring on this trip.
some more cool stuff. Level 7 is an ass most of the time. So this is gonna suck. Oh, it gave me the thing. That's gonna make things a lot better, actually. Ah, get out! Ah! What is this thing on my shoulder? I don't even know! Level 7 is a bitch. I'm gonna die. Almost certainly. Oh, I leveled up! Everything's fine! I died on level 7 like twice in my previous play. I didn't save the dude, he's dead, but wow. At least I survived. Jesus Christ, level 7, man. I think it's time to leave with my stuff. I'll talk to Enji. What's up? Right, so he's gonna make us a thing. But we gotta go back to the field until then. Get off there. The events that have transpired are those. Nobody cares. Back to the field! Gotta kill more things! I bet you'd love me to go check out the new guns and suits that we can build, right? Except we can't. I went back there like seven times last time. Could never afford anything until like the very end. grind for stuff in this game is a little bit is extreme. Aim the gun, because you can't shoot down with this thing. Just makes me use a bunch of shotgun instead. Wow. This thing just keeps coming back. this layout. Wow, look at all these dudes.
Is that just that? One thing? I'll take all the money, sure, whatever. Free money. Ronin! What's this? Wubba lubba dub dub! It's actually Rick. Wait, wait, who are you? Wait, th this is Ambush! I don't know about this, Rick. I don't know about this Ambush. So it's a Gordivore. It's got a shield. Doesn't matter. We're gonna just destroy everything anyway. Right, the bees. What's up? Wubba lubba dub dub! And that's exactly what we're gonna do. Straight back to the base. Just to save time. <laughs> 